The James Webb Space Telescope has uncovered mysterious lights in space that even NASA can't explain. From unusually bright galaxies to puzzling signals, these discoveries are challenging our understanding of the universe. Join us today as we explore the cosmic enigmas baffling scientists. Number 10, earliest galaxies ever observed. James Webb amazed scientists by revealing galaxies like Sears 93316, which was formed 300 million years after the Big Bang. Sounds like a long time ago, it's actually quite recent in regards of, you know, our existence. These ancient structures, visible after 13 billion years of light travel, offer a glimpse into the universe's cosmic dawn, right? The early beginning phase, when the first stars began shaping the cosmos. Unexpectedly bright and massive for their time, these galaxies challenge existing theories about early star and galaxy formation. James Webb's infrared vision pierces cosmic dust, revealing details unseen by telescopes like Hubble in the past. This groundbreaking discovery reshapes our understanding of the universe's origins and raises new questions about dark matter, early black holes, and the rapid emergence of galaxies. Number nine, detailed atmospheres. James Webb has transformed exoplanet research by analyzing distant atmospheres with remarkable precision. Now, it examined WASP 96b, which is a gas giant, 1,150 light years away, and it detected water vapor, clouds, and haze, proving its ability to reveal the chemical makeup of far off worlds looks pretty similar to our world here. By capturing starlight passing through a planet's atmosphere during transit and then splitting it into a spectrum, James Webb unveils molecular compositions, climate, and even weather. It's like a weatherman for other planets. That's crazy. How do we see the weather on other planets? And we don't know if aliens are real yet. Like, how do we do that? This breakthrough is vital for identifying potentially habitable planets and guiding future missions to explore worlds that might harbor life. Of course, advancing our understanding of planetary systems. This is ringing interstellar to me. Don't go, Murph, don't go. Number eight, carbon dioxide detected on an exoplanet. In another groundbreaking moment, James Webb detected carbon dioxide in the atmosphere of WASP 39b, a hot gas giant 700 light years away. This marked the first time ever that this crucial molecule was identified in an exoplanetary atmosphere. Carbon dioxide is an essential marker because its presence can reveal key details about a planet's formation, history, and its chemical processes. For planets closer to Earth-like conditions, carbon dioxide could also be a sign of biological or geological activity. This detection demonstrated James Webb's unmatched sensitivity and precision in analyzing the atmospheres of distant worlds. Even those with challenging conditions, life still may exist. Wasp 39B itself is inhospitable to life, but the methods developed here will be crucial in studying smaller, rocky planets in these habitable zones of their stars. So we're not quite there, but we're getting close. Number seven, glowing cosmic cliffs. James Webb's stunning image of the cosmic cliffs in the Carina Nebula unveiled star-forming regions in unprecedented detail. This photo honestly blows my mind. Located 7,600 light years away, this stellar nursery has been obscured until the telescope's infrared capability Ability, then revealed hundreds of hidden stars and structures. And by say hundreds, I mean thousands. There's so many. The cliffs mark the edge of a massive cavity carved by radiation from young, massive stars. Jets of material from forming stars were also captured, offering insights into how stars grow and interact with their environment. This discovery sheds light, pun intended, on the process behind star formation, including the origins of our sun and solar system. Yeah, where do we come from? Where did our star come from? We're getting close. Number six. Stefan's Quintet, Galaxies in Collision. James Webb observations of Stefan's Quintet, a group of five interacting galaxies 290 million light years away, revealed tidal tails, shock waves, and bursts of star formation, all caused by gravitational interactions. The photo is pretty intense. All these galaxies are mixing together. It's almost in action. The telescope also captured how powerful winds from a supermassive black hole in NG67319 affect surrounding gas and dust, offering insights into black holes role in star formations. Now these findings help scientists study galactic collisions, key drivers of galaxy evolution, and they hint at the Milky Way's future collision with Andromeda. So we're kind of getting a little teaser trailer for what's coming with uh, our galaxy. Spoiler alert, it's gonna be loud. It's gonna be real hot and real loud. Number five, oldest known star clusters. James Webb has identified some of the oldest star clusters ever observed, dating back to nearly the dawn of the universe. That's old, it's older than your mom. 
Haha. <laughs> these clusters, these dense groups of stars bound by gravity, provide a window into the early area of star formation, right? This early, early time. The dawn of the universe, perhaps. Their age suggests that they were formed shortly after the first galaxies, offering clues about the conditions of the early universe. By analyzing these clusters, scientists can refine models of stellar evolution and understand how the first heavy elements like carbon and oxygen were created and then, more importantly, dispersed. These findings are essential for tracing the chemical enrichment of the cosmos, which ultimately led to the formation of planets and life. So this photo right here is the beginning of all of us. Hit that like button. That's the OG right there. Number four, organic molecules in the Orion Nebula. James Webb made a groundbreaking discovery in the Orion Nebula by detecting complex organic molecules, such as hydrocarbons, within this massive star-forming region. Now these molecules are considered the building blocks of life you and I right now, indicating that the conditions necessary for life might be widespread across the galaxy and not just here on our planet Earth. The Orion Nebula is located just 1300 light years away, marking it one of the most studied star forming regions. However, James Webb's infrared capabilities reveal details that have been invisible, virtually invisible until right now, such as how these molecules are shielded from harsh radiation from surrounding dust clouds. This discovery supports the theory that life's ingredients are readily available throughout the the cosmos. Of course, this increases the likelihood that life exists beyond Earth. Yikes, that's scary. Number three, water and distant debris disks. <laughs> distant debris disks. It's an alliteration. James Webb detected water vapor, believe it or not, in the debris disk of a young star system, offering a brief glimpse into the role of water in planet formation. Now, debris disks are composed of gas, dust, and planetesimals, and they often resemble the early conditions of our own solar system. That's why we study them. The presence of water suggests that such systems could produce habitable worlds. Ugh, oh, this is making me feel sick. This finding underscores the importance of water in creating life friendly environments and supports the idea that water delivery via comets or asteroids could be a universal process, right? Life is happening everywhere. It's just right here is the only one we got. By studying these disks, scientists gain insight into the factors that contribute to the emergence of habitable planets. Yeah, we see water flying through the sky. We're going to follow it. Where's that going to land? Who is that? Number two, the most precise image of Neptune's rings. This one's cool. James Webb captured the sharpest view of Neptune's faint rings in over three decades, alongside intricate details of the planet's atmosphere, which we've never seen before, or at least never like this. This image revealed high altitude methane ice clouds and a mysterious band circling the planet. Neptune, an ice giant, remains one of the least understood planets in our solar system. So this new data helps scientists unravel its atmospheric dynamics and the composition of its rings. Also, it has rings, which could of course shed light on the process that shaped our outer solar system. This discovery highlights James Webb's ability to revolutionize planetary science, even within our own celestial backyard. We thought we knew it. Turns out we don't. Has a ring. All right. It's married. Love that. And finally, number one, distant galaxies with surprising structures. James Webb uncovered galaxies in the early universe with unexpectedly mature structures, such as these well-defined spiral arms, like these spiral arms, only larger. These findings challenge existing models of galaxy formation, which suggest that galaxies in the early cosmos should appear chaotic and irregular. This discovery raises questions about the role of dark matter and other factors in shaping these massive galaxies. It also suggests that some galaxies formed and evolved faster than we previously thought. Yeah, they're a grower and also a shower. By studying these ancient structures, scientists gain new insights into the process that govern the growth and evolution of galaxies across cosmic time, which of course helps us understand our existence and our solar system and where we came from. Isn't that neat? Thanks, James Webb. I've been your host, James Webb, and I'll see you next time. See you later. Curious about the mysteries of deep space? Strange signals from far beyond Earth have puzzled scientists for years, and some even hint at extraterrestrial life. Today, we'll explore 10 of the most mysterious deep space signals ever discovered. Let's dive in. I should have wore like the tinfoil hat for this one. Would have been fun.